this is Everyday Grammar. I'm Kaveh. And I'm Lucia. Today we want to provide you with some explanations on how to use the prepositions with, to, and for with the verb provide. Can you even use different prepositions with the same verb? Sure you can. Here's our first example. Tom's visit to the United States provided him with an opportunity to learn English. When the verb provide is followed by an indirect object, him, you need to use with. Providing someone with something means to give something that the person wanted or needed. Providing for can mean to make something happen in the future or make something available to a person. Exactly. Like Tom will provide for his family while he's away. So providing something to or for someone usually means that you are giving something to someone. Here's another example. The restaurant provides free appetizers to all its customers. Free appetizers is the direct object and customers is the indirect object. But you could also say the restaurant provides free appetizers for all its customers. Both are correct. This was a dense lesson, but we provided a lot of information to our viewers. We sure did. And that's Everyday Grammar.